Hello everyone. Um, hi. I want to introduce myself and show my face to you, my my fellow tarantula YouTubers especially. Um, thank you for accepting me as part of the tarantula YouTube community. I really appreciate it and I'm really enjoying getting to know people and I tell you, I wake up in the morning, first thing with my coffee, I'm looking at your videos and they're very entertaining. I love it and I just think it's, it's just a, such a wonderful idea. Um, Exotics Lair, I think you came up with the idea of starting the YouTube community. Um, I know Kat has been huge help and like coming up with the, the tarantula Q&A um, I think I'm ready I think I'm ready to do that uh, I've had a YouTube channel for my ducks you can hear my goose in the background and my ducks I've had their channel since oh my gosh so long um, in fact I have one video on there that the other day it seems like it went viral or something it's had almost a hundred thousand views and I don't know why um, but now I'm thinking maybe I need to backtrack and pay more attention to my duck channel. Um, I have so much footage from so many years and such stories that I can tell. But this is what's giving me that confidence. So I just want you to know that this is a wonderful thing that you've started. And um, I, I need, I need this confidence because um, I've really been stumbling and fumbling around in my life. Um, trying to overcome a lot of social anxiety. Um, I tried having readings because I, I'm a writer, I'm supposed to be writing, but I'm terrified of reading in front of people. So when I would have readings, I would have someone else host, and finally I even quit that. And I spend a lot of my time at home with my animals. I've been so hesitant to, you know, put my face out on on, it, on screen, um, on YouTube. Um, don't even do that in my duck videos, but I can see that showing your face and letting people get to know you, it really makes a difference. And of those of you who have shown your face and, it, and have been reluctant to, I just want to say that it does make a difference. I, I see it now. I used to think, who'd, who'd be interested in me? Who would want to see me? Who wants to hear me talk? You know, who wants to see my face? But now that I see your faces, and then I go back and I look at my duck channel, and I'm like, oh, okay. I don't even know who this person is. Why would I want to watch this? It makes such a huge difference. So once again, thank you. Thank you very much. And I uh, can't wait to grow and learn and see what you come up with in your videos next. So it's time to do some spring cleaning. I've got my koi pond here and it's a mess. It's been winterized and I'm going to drain the water out with my nifty little pump and refill it with clean water. Okay. It's finally getting warm enough out here um, where I live in eastern Washington in the United States. Um, but I'm starting to find some invertebrates and something that I just found is this little sling. Maybe it's a juvenile. Juvenile, it's probably uh, one of the former Pigeonaria species. Um, possibly the one that they call the, the uh, hobo spider here. And it made a was making a nest under one of these rocks, which is where the the female was last year. So just taking place in the next generation. You can see it in there or not. I just look at my hair. I just fell backwards and rolled uh, right next to the koi pond. I'm changing their water and I had it almost all the way drained out and one of the fish jumped and I don't know if it scared me or what and I just keeled over backwards and almost did a somersault so yep but uh, I have a couple of shout outs um, one is to West Coast Arachnids and that is because uh, you told me 
on my um, uh, do-it-yourself enclosure video that my green bottle blue was in serious pre-molt and was going to molt any day and it sure enough a couple days later that's what happened so uh, definitely credit to you for calling that west coast arachnids um, also eerie arachnids dave i want to say hi and i want to thank you for doing the video about the m balfouri for me i really appreciate that and um yeah so Good luck to you. And if you haven't seen those channels, um, Eerie Arachnids, uh, West Coast Arachnids, go check them out. Really cool stuff. bites more? Ducks or tarantulas? <laughs> now here's who should be in the, this should be like a natidaphobia movie. Forget about arachnophobia. Bites more ducks or tarantulas. Definitely the duck. I don't know where they think they're going. Somewhere. Okay. It's a mess around here. It's uh springtime, so you know how much ducks poop. They poop all winter. This is my goose Freddy. Hi, for him. He wants to do more than say hi. We can't allow that. Oh, what a day. 